I'd like to show you how you can use a web tool called Screencast Snagit to record audio over a slideshow. So the first thing you're going to do is go to your Google Drive and find your slideshow. So here's a sample slide deck I have of just some random pictures. The next thing that you're going to do is make sure that you have the Snagit um, screen capture, screen casting tool installed. If you don't see this uh, blue Snagit icon, then what you'll have to do is go to the Chrome Web Store. You can just type in Chrome Web Store into Google, type in the word Snagit, and then you'll want to install both the Snagit app, which is right here, and the Snagit extension, which is right here. To install those, you'll just click where it says free, and once it's installed, you'll have a green rate it button, and then you'll know that you're good to go. So once you have your Snagit installed, you're going to go ahead and go to your slide deck. You're going to click on Snagit, and then under video, you're going to click screen. And it will ask you what you want to record, the entire screen, just the slideshow, or whatever you have open. So I'm going to click on sample slide deck, share, and then present. When I do that, I'm now capturing my full screen. And I can scroll through my slideshow. So I can talk about the first slide. This slideshow will be about the four seasons that we see in Michigan. The first of those that I'm going to discuss is summer. And I can click through my slideshow and go to autumn and then winter and then spring. And I will narrate everything as I go. When I'm done recording my Snagit, I'll just click Stop Sharing. And when I do that, it brings up my slideshow. I can click play and I can see in here. When I do that, I'm now capturing my So once I have that recorded the way I want it, which it might take you a few times to do, you can go ahead and give it a name. And then one of the really nice features of Snagit is it connects with your Google. So if I go down to the right hand corner, I can click on these three dots and I can say I want the Google Drive link. You can also send it to YouTube. But if you go to the Google Drive link, then you'll be able to easily share it with your teacher by just sending them the link from Google Drive or inserting it into your Google Classroom to turn it in. So that's how it is, easy it is to use Snagit to record voice over your Google Slideshow. Thanks.